Hey, and thank you for watching my second tutorial on how to program using the Java language. Uh, before I get started, I should say that I'm using the Eclipse IDE, and I will leave links in the video description. If you don't already have it, you can download it. It's free to download. There's really no reason for you not to get it. So today, the program that we will be writing will basically get the length and the width of a rectangle from a user. It's going to do a calculation, and then it's going to take that calculation and output that variable to the system console. Now I already have a couple lines written here. The first thing that you're going to want to do is import java.util.scanner and what that's going to allow us to do is get input from the user. So it's essential. Next we're going to come down to the main part of the program and declare our variables. So for this we're going to need the length, the width, and the area Okay, so now that we have our variables, we have to get something from the user. So come down here, what you want to do is type scanner input equals new scanner, and then in parentheses, system.in. Next, we're going to ask the user to enter the length. Now we're going to take user input and put it into the length variable. And we're going to do the same for the width. I like to just copy and paste code and change the variable really quick. So we're just going to change this to width and we're going to change this one down here to width. So let's run that really quick and make sure that everything's working. And you see over here it asks for the length in meters. So let's just put 5, the width in meters, 2 and nothing happens because we haven't told it to do anything else. So now what we're going to need to do is do a calculation and in order to calculate area we just multiply length times the width. So just type area equals length times width. Last we're going to output area to the system console. And we can do that by typing system.out.println And at this point, we're just going to click Run again. So Run, OK to save. Enter the length in meters. Let's enter 5. Enter the width in meters. Put whatever you want. I'm going to put 3, so the answer should be 15. The area is 15.0 square meters. So that worked just fine. 